time for a break. We've come a long way, but there's a lot more to go. In the following sections, we'll cover a broad array of topics, including disclosures and notices, conveyance of a property, the statute of frauds, default and breach of contract, and remedies for breach of contract. The subjects we're about to tackle cover the issues that arise in contract situations from multiple angles. We'll talk about the seller's responsibilities and disclosures, including a look at the seller's disclosure form, and we'll discuss a number of notices and addenda that may be required with a listing. We'll spend a few minutes on conveying property and what happens if a property in a transaction is destroyed during the process and why the timing can determine who will suffer the loss. From there, we'll review the role of the signatures and the statute of frauds in the contract process and then wrap things up with an in-depth look into breach of contract issues as well as the defense and the remedies available for breaches. We have a lot ahead. So let's get started.